Welcome to the Dickinson Marine YouTube channel. In this video, we're going to be installing a P9000 fireplace. Before we get into it, please know that these instructions apply to the P9000 as well as the P12000 model. We start with the chimney cap and gasket. These require a minimum 3 inch hole to pass through the roof. If needed, mark and drill pilot holes for the mounting screws, but do so without drilling through the rubber gasket to prevent leaks. Complete the cap install by tightening down each screw to compress the gasket underneath. Attach the dress ring from inside before installing the chimney. Use the chimney pipes to estimate where the fireplace will be mounted. Make sure the location will allow for the safety clearances listed in the manual. Attach both pipes as far as they will go onto the fireplace. The inner pipe should protrude slightly above the outer. Shorten the chimney pipes if needed by compressing them. Lengthen a pipe by stretching it out and returning it to straight. Push upwards on the fireplace to seat the chimney pipes as deep as they will go into the cap on the roof. With the chimney pipes firmly sandwiched in between the fireplace and the cap, you can attach the back plate to the wall. When attaching, make sure you remember to level the fireplace before you tighten the screws. Next, identify the power wire from your 12 volt power source and attach it to the red wire from the fireplace. Attach the neutral wire to the black wire from the fireplace. Activate the fan by flipping the switch on, then rotate clockwise to increase fan speed. Rotate counterclockwise to reduce fan speed. To connect the gas, take your low pressure propane hose and thread it onto the inlet fitting by hand to make sure it's threading on correctly and not being forced. To tighten the connection, grip the elbow fitting with one wrench to prevent it from turning and tighten the hose using another wrench. Before testing the fireplace, make sure to remove all traces of protective plastic from it. In order to light the fireplace, unscrew the latch and open the door. The fireplace must be lit by hand. Push the gas control in and rotate counterclockwise to the 9 o'clock position. Holding the control in will release gas into the burner. Ignite this gas at the burner using a barbecue lighter. Continue to hold down the control as you reseal the door and until the burner has warmed up enough to establish gas flow. To select the high position, push in the control and rotate counterclockwise to the 7 o'clock position. If you'd like to learn more about the P9000 or the P12000 fireplace, their install options, maintenance, and much more, please head over to DickinsonMarine.com and download the owner's manual under the support tab. As always, thank you for watching and supporting our channel.